I am being kidnapped to go to one of their houses. Da? Mama? Mama? Baba? Uchti? Wachi? We left Kelagi at 10 a.m. Transit Dubai, Transit Istanbul, and now just landed in Beirut and another hour's journey to the hotel. This is my first project photographing an aid mission, this time round with Chinta Syria Malaysia and 10 other well-known Malaysian volunteers and team. We're off for two weeks in January 2020. Hi. 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 First stop on the first day is uh, a hospital called Arsal. We are giving away some of, I think, the resources. The area of Arsal is about one hour plus from where our hotel is. So this hospital is the nearest one to the camps. It was started by seven refugee doctors and volunteers, and it's funded by your donations. They could use all the help they can get. Kalau korang tengok kemah dia, guna kayu frame, cement floor, dengan canvas je. It's our third camp. Basically what we're doing is just distributing petrol, food, sweets. We are working with the local NGO, Urda. So they determine sumbangan apa yang diperlukan dan berapa banyak from Malaysia, we collect the donations, we pass it to them, they buy the supplies and we come to help distribute. Besides life supplies, we also buy toys for the children. It's our second day. We're visiting some mission projects today, a medical centre, but first stop, school. Shinta Serial Malaysia is going to open up their fourth school here for the evening sessions. Next camp, we're stopping by Al Yasmin. Right now it's winter and it's very wet and later this month it will snow. So it's really important that we give enough for them to last through this month. But the kids here are so full of energy, mashallah. I am being kidnapped. Mama? Mama? Baba? Uchti? Wachi? Okay. What do you have Mama! Salam alaikum. Salam alaikum. So, the living room is wrong. The tempat fridge. It's fridge. All their winter coats. So, more much. Pickled um, to preserve it. Small kitchen. Okay, we're going to try and print it out. Let's see. <laughs> Bye. Shukran. Look at nampak. Yeah, hancho hancho ni. It's all um, concrete buildings. That the government hancurkan sebab dia orang tak bagi any permanent structures. So yang tinggal adalah hanya rumah-rumah kontena dan kemah. So korang bayangkan, it's so cold in the winter. Tapi memang tak boleh buat rumah batu. This is only a bit of snow. It's gonna get worse. I can't imagine how people are going to cope in the cold. Yeah. Okay, kurang kalau datang ke Lebanon. Bawa lah baju tu tebal. Day three, more camps. We are on the way to a bread factory where we sponsor ingredients and some equipment. They are making bread from scratch to be given out at the camps later. Each family gets about ten, I think. The factory made more than forty thousand pieces of bread, and kita tolong bungkuskan dan rasa sikit. 
So this is the mobile clinic. It's very small. They come every week with volunteer doctors to check up on their patients and get medical supplies. We continue to visit more camps in Beka. The reality of it is that kadang-kadang memang agak huru hara. But here, we give blankets, toys and bread. Ini makcik ni. Kawasan perumahan dia dah banji. Sebab sekarang tengah musim hujan dan musim snow. Lepas tu tadi dia tengah cuba, dia tengah cuba sapukan sian. Yeah. Syukran. Sekarang kita ada bagi some families coupon untuk dorang beli baju winter. The NGO here connects with local shops to supply proper attires for winter. They get to choose what they want and what suits them. Alhamdulillah. So Dot, what's going on? Kita akan ada cara hafazan Al-Quran sama-sama okay. dengan anak-anak Syria di camp ni ok so, kita akan terus serta membaca beberapa surah so Alhamdulillah we've been in Lebanon about 5 days it's been eye-opening but the best part is seeing the children and the people still smiling and playing even though they're facing terrible living conditions. Please help. Your donations will help us with this mission. Now, on to Syria and Turkey.